Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you guys are new. So, I'm seriously so excited for today's video because it has literally been so long since I've done a store walkthrough with you guys and there have been so many new spring items at Bath & Body Works. So, I thought it'd be fun to go into Bath & Body Works walk around the whole store, see what kind of new items they have out on the floor, and just share with you guys all of the new spring goodness that is coming up, and all of like the fun like Easter stuff too, because I know they already have Easter out, so I'm excited to check all of that stuff out. So let's go on into Bath & Body Works and let's go check her out. <laughs> Alright you guys, so when you first walk in, you're going to see this whole entire like tropical collection right up on the floor at the front of the store. So we have our Fiji Sunshine Guavatini. We also have the Pink Pineapple Sunrise, which they're calling Costa Rica now. And then we also have our Thailand, which is Sweet Kiwi and Star Fruit. Okay, so I'm curious to see what this one smells like. I don't know if I have this one in my collection or if it's like a brand new one, but it has notes of golden kiwi, juicy star fruit, and solar woods. Y'all, that smells so good. That's seriously like so summery. You can definitely get that juiciness of that star fruit. On the back, it just says, breathe in the sweet scent of fresh kiwi and starfruit while relaxing on a tranquil beach. Welcome to Thailand. Y'all, this one smells so good, and I do love the packaging on this one. If you guys are interested in this, it looks like it does come in the body wash. We also have the fine fragrance mist, and then they also have the exfoliating body scrub. I wonder if they have like a cream for this, but they also do have the candle though. But I wonder if there's like a uh, body butters. And like body cream for this guy so far I'm not seeing it but anyways just moving around to the other side we have the Bahamas which is passion fruit and banana flower we all know this is literally a sunscreen scent if you guys are into that definitely pick this up and then moving on to the right we have the Waikiki beach coconut as well and then both of these do come in a candle. We have the Waikiki Beach Coconut Candle, and then we have a Beach Weather Candle as well. Right behind this display, we have the brand new Tropidelic Fragrance. This guy has notes of Passion Flower, Yin Yang, and then the Misty Rainforest. So we have the lotion, we have the body wash, we have the bar soap, they actually have the perfume, body scrub, they have the Diamond Shimmer Mist, full-size candle, and then we also have the single white candle as well. Seriously, you guys, so much. Like, they did a full-on collection for this fragrance. This is a little close-up of the Frying Fragrance Mousse. All right, here's a little close-up of the actual perfume. It's honestly, like, I'm not the biggest fan of the bottle or, like, the packaging on the actual perfume. It's a little just, like, I don't know, just a little boring in my opinion, but the actual packaging when it comes in the box, I do like a lot. To give you guys, like, my best description on the new Tropidelic fragrance, like, I don't know, it just smells like a more sophisticated slash mature version of this guy back here like definitely still a little sunscreeny a little sandy like I don't know that's just what I'm getting from this fragrance and like I don't know I think it's great I think it's super fun for summer but on an everyday kind of stuff or on an everyday kind of wear definitely pass and then just moving on to the left we have all of our tropical hand soaps so we have pink pineapple sunrise mango papaya paradise sunlit palm trees electric limeade waikiki beach coconut turquoise water sea seaside cove island margarita mahogany coconut mango mai tai passion fruit and banana flower seriously so many fun summery hand soaps over here we have all of our summer candles which they're calling the neon dream which i do like a lot so let's see we have coconut pina colada i love the packaging on this guy i love that sticker we have beach weather hibiscus waterfalls they also have the ice dragon fruit tea such a good strong candle you guys waikiki beach coconut warm ocean breeze pink pineapple sunrise What's this one back here? Warm ocean breeze again. Seriously, you guys, so good. And then look at these. There's this fun little candle holder as well, so cute. And then they also have a bunch of new wallflower plugins as well. I'll get into those later. 
some wallflowers. On the other side, we have ocean driftwood, island margarita. We have a strawberry daiquiri, such a good one as well. We also just have our regular core candles. And then over here, this is a brand new one that I have not seen before. Wild rose and suede, pink tea rose, soft suede, and warm amber. I wonder what this one smells like. I would definitely have this one in the bathroom. Again, pink tea rose, soft suede, and warm amber. Like it's like a soft rose, definitely velvety. So good. We also have blue verbena and lime, which is sugared lime, zesty verbena, and then garden thyme. Palo Santo, Endless Weekend, Blue Icelandic Waters, that's an interesting one. Blueberry and Oob, Pink Lavender Espresso, Raspberries and Whipped Vanilla. To the right of that, we also have these new ones, Bergamot and Birch, Lavender Vetiver, Greenhouse Fern. I believe these two are Reek packages. Greenhouse Fern though, you guys, has notes of Lush Bergamot, Violet Leaves, and then Jasmine Blooms. I love the packaging on this one. Right under those, we have a flower child, eucalyptus rain, more eucalyptus rain, and then more of the flower child. All right, you guys, we have more three wick candles over here, which I guess are part of the Black History Month collection. So we have Anna's Garden, which has notes of orange blossom, white tea, jasmine musk. We have my sister, oh, my sweet sisters. We have sugared cinnamon, toasted hazelnut cake batter. That is definitely one that I'm gonna have to smell because that sounds so good. And then we have Gwen's Note, which has notes of creamy sandalwood, sage, and soft lavender. And then the last one that we have is You, Me, and the Sea, which has notes of blue orchid, fresh eucalyptus, salt water. Oh, I'm so curious about this one. Like, wait, that one smells so good. Like I definitely wanna have like that one in the kitchen. That one smells so good, you guys. Definitely try My Sweet Sisters, that one's so good. And then just on the other side, they also have the same candles and then they have these beautiful candle holders, which I believe match like the candles because we have the pink, we have the green, and then I wonder if there's blue, well, maybe no blue. Easter time. So we have Happy Easter, which this is a new fragrance with Daffodil Daydreams. So I actually already smelled this at the Bath and Body Works that's in my college town, or like 40 minutes from my college town. But this guy has notes of whipped marshmallow, pastel clouds, and sweet daffodil. This is such a good, yummy, cotton candy, marshmallowy kind of fragrance. I definitely need to pick one up right now, and they are $10 off today. Not the best deal, but it is something definitely love. There's also this cute little Easter bunny as well here with its cute little carrot. I love that so much. They also have the Daffodil Daydreams in a hand soap as well. So fun, you guys. We also have Cottontail Cake Pop. That sounds so good. Look at this cute little backpack, you guys. It's a cute little pink elephant. I love that. But they also have these brand new candles. We have Paris Cafe, which is a repackage. But they also have this brand new scent, which is Cherry Blossom Pound Cake. The pound cake in this one is definitely the same pound cake from Strawberry Pound Cake, just a cherry version now. So good, you guys. This guy has notes of Cherry Blossom Whipped Pound Cake and Vanilla Frosting. That is definitely one that I need to get and try out for you guys. We have Hello Beautiful. And then I believe over here, yes, we have Main Street Bakery. I wonder if this is the banana pudding candle that was out a couple years ago because that's definitely what I'm getting notes of, especially from this. We have fresh banana, vanilla wafers, and then cinnamon sugar. Smells so good, you guys. All right, we're gonna go ahead and move on to the men's section. So we have our regular fresh water, noir, ocean, but there are some brand new scents right now. We have the Ridgeline, and then we also have Canyon, which the Canyon one's the one that's calling my name right now. This guy has notes of black pepper, desert sand, and crisp vetiver. Already those notes is definitely something that I would wear. Love that so much. And then here's just like an overview of the other ones. Okay, so it looks like there's some new aromatherapy as well. We have Himalayan Oasis. We have Rainfall Retreat. So there's the body wash, the body cream, the mist. Y'all, that sounds so good. What is this? I have not seen this before. Okay, so I just read it and it looks like they actually have shave gels now, which is so cool. I didn't even know that they came out with those. But then there's also the body scrub as well. All right, talking about wallflowers now, there are so many fun new wallflower plugins. We have a little beer for like March, 
rainbow also just for like the St. Patrick's vibes. They also have this pretty like sunflower thing going on. The beautiful turtles. Wonder if there's any new scents. Okay, so there is. We have the new sweet kiwi and star fruit, that new fragrance that's out up at the front. We have sheer peach. I wonder if there's any other new ones, you guys. Okay, looks like coconut pina colada is also a brand new one. Pink pineapple punch. We have the spring clothes line. I love any like laundry kind of smell, and I feel like that's definitely gonna be a laundry vibe. We also have pink lavender and espresso in the wallflower now, which is so fun. And then we also have the new blueberry bellini. Definitely wanna smell that right now. Y'all, the way that I have to prop you guys up is so funny right now. Sorry if the camera's crooked. <laughs> Let's go ahead and smell this one. Wait. This one's definitely giving like a Jolly Rancher kind of vibes. I don't know why. It literally is giving me like a Blueberry Jolly Rancher. That smells so good. There's also the brand new Water Lily Springs and then Wild Rose and Suede, that candle that we smelled in the Wallflower now. All right, you guys, I found more of the three wick candles. We have Wild Berry Jam Donut, Palo Santo and Sage, and then here is that brand new spring clothesline. All right, you guys, let's go ahead and smell this one. This guy has notes of lemon water, sun-dried blossoms, and golden amber. Okay, definitely not what I was expecting. It's definitely the opposite from like a laundry kind of smell that they usually have. It's definitely really strong on the lemon. And then the, also this, also the wicks on this one are so thin too, so I feel like you're gonna be setting a lot with that one. one of my favorites, fresh sheets as well as here. Oh my gosh, I love that one so much. Okay, one of my favorites, Sweet Red Mango. Such a good, strong summer candle. Like this one, seriously, one of the strongest candles that I have ever burned. I love it so much. Definitely need a backup. And then we also have Prosecco and Peaches as well. And then we also have like the coordinating like hand soaps as well. All right, let's go ahead and see if there are any new room sprays. Same old, same old, same old. Let's see, Fresh Cut Lilacs, Flower Child, the Sheer Peach one. I wonder what this one smells like, y'all. Okay, wait, I do like that one a lot. That one smells so good. Patchouli and Rosewood. Let's see. Is that the only new one right now? Oh, they also have that spring clothesline one in the room spray, but I think that is all of like the new ones right now. This one, y'all, so good. I love that one. Look at this like little like beehive, honeycomb vibe kind of candle holder. This one's so pretty. I love the orange on this. I also love that little bee, it's so pretty. All right, I'm just looking at all of the wallflower plugins now. There's this pretty flower one, the little hummingbird, basket of succulents, this little mushroom one, so cute. I love that one a lot. This little butterfly, the lightning bolt, so fun. Little pineapple, love that one as well, so summery. The little flamingo, the little drink. The lemons, more birds. This one is so fun. Like, I definitely want that one. I feel like that one you could have like spring and summertime. So, it would definitely last you like two seasons. Okay, so we're gonna wrap up by looking at all of like the wall. Oh my gosh, wallflowers. We're gonna wrap up and look at all of like the pocket backs, the pocket back holders, because I feel like there are definitely like a lot of new ones that I wanna check out. So, let's go ahead and do that. You guys, look at this pineapple mango one. I love the packaging on this one so much. This one's so cute. Let's see, any other new ones? Not seen any other new ones yet. Okay, so they do have the Tropidolic Pocket back here as well, so I feel like this one would be so fun to have in the summertime. They also have a Strawberry Kiwi one as well. This one's so fun as well. Okay, look at all of these pocket back holders. Look at the Gummy Bear one. This Gummy Bear one is so fun, I need this one. Oh, there's also a yellow one as well. This one's so cute. I love that one. And then let's see There's a little sushi one. This one's so fun a little astronaut on the little rocket We also have this little like shark one as well There's also like this fun one. I feel like a lot of like little girls would like this one They also brought back more of like the dog ones with the little bags inside. There's an actual dog one too with like a little tennis ball this little cloud with rainbows on it What's this one, you guys? A little cheerleader one as well. So fun. 
raspberry tangerine pocket back. There's also the pink pineapple sunrise one. Ban passion fruit and banana flower. They also have the turquoise waters, island margarita. So many fun summery ones. They have Calypso Clementine as well. Alright you guys, so I just got out of Bath and Body Works and it was so fun and so refreshing to be in there. Like it has literally been so long since I've been into Bath and Body Works. Like just being at college and stuff, it's been like so tough trying to get to Bath and Body Works because the nearest one is 45 minutes away. And also just being like a college student now, like I can't spend like what I used to spend like before I was in college. Like I actually have to budget things out now and it's just like so hard and just so like annoying. But I hope you guys understand why like there really hasn't been like any like Bath and Body Works content recently. It's just seriously been so hard to try and like manage everything and try to budget everything too. I'm gonna try my best to get content out for you guys. I also wanted to ask you guys what kind of content do you guys want to see on my channel because I'm fine still including a couple Bath and Body Works videos here and there but I don't want my channel to just be Bath and Body Works and I feel like I've said that in the past too but I really just want to do a lot of more lifestyle kind of content I'm also trying to decide if I start vlogging on this channel now too and leave my vlog channel in the past but I'm also just a little like nervous to do so just because I have all my vlogs over there and I do like having that little separation but I don't know it's just hard so definitely a lot of like thinking that I need to do I also do want to do like a fun little car tour for you guys as well now that the weather is starting to warm up a little bit like I'm literally sweating right now it's currently 60 degrees right now here in Utah which is crazy because literally two days ago it was snowing but I do want to do like a fun little car tour for you guys. I just want to do fun videos now that spring and summer is approaching and I need a little help. I want to know what you guys want to see. So if you guys have any fun ideas of videos that you want me to create for you guys, then definitely let me know. Leave them down in the comments below. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys. I'm not leaving